Today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to build a lightning staff in Origins and this will also work in Origins Remastered in Black Ops 3 Zombies and this is going to be an updated guide and I will also be showing you guys how you can actually build it and then upgrade the lightning staff. Once again this is going to work whether you wanna play the original Origins in Black Ops 2 or the Origins Remastered in Black Ops 3 Zombies. All the steps are the same and I will also include all other staffs guide in the description if you need help building them as well and the lightning staff is the last guide that I'm currently recording. Also, I'm doing a Zombies Chronicles giveaway. To enter, make sure you are subscribed, which I'm sure you are, and follow the link in the description. But hey everybody, what the heck is going on? My name is Usman, and let's just get right into it. Now, if you happen to be new to my channel, definitely do consider subscribing. We do daily videos and live streams, and now, in order to make the staff, you need a couple of things, of course, like the parts and everything like that, but we also need the gramophone and the black record, because that will allow you to teleport to the crazy place where all the magic happens. Consider this a key to opening up portals. Now the gramophone always spawns in underneath the excavation side which is under the pack punch. It's not the first thing you need to go and do but you definitely need it like I said earlier to open up portals and teleport and you also need the black record. Now there are three locations for the black record. It's always going to spawn around the excavation side near the pack punch. It's always always going to be around this area. It's either going to be right right here or it can be right here as soon as you purchase this door very very easy to see or it can be on the flip side right here you will see by the boxes on the crates right here uh, near the crates I should say so that's the black record and this is a key if you guys want to open up the down part for the excavation side and that needs to be open so you can go ahead and build your staffs and get the normal unupgraded staffs. of course you need to get the unupgraded staff first in order to upgrade that so the black record is a key for opening up the down part of the excavation side and the gramophone is a mixer that will play that black record and it will be inside the excavation side to the right of the table or on the left side of the table very very easy to see and very very easy to get it's always going to be right here simply pick that shit up place it on the table and play that black record jam and it will open the stairways and you will be able to craft your staffs down there once you have the parts this needs to be done so do it while you're collecting parts and opening up the map and shit like that now now you need the purple record aka the lightning strap record which is always going to spawn around the generator number 4 aka juggernaut and the first location is going to be on the wagon which is going to be very very close to juggernaut and the second location is going to be very close okay this is like a real one this is going to be very close to juggernaut and it's going to be on the table right here and the last location is going to be inside the wind staff tunnel right here as soon as you get this you can now go ahead and get the wind staff crystal and the only way to get the crystal is by going from its original portal and we're going from the lightning staff portal which is going to be near stamina up near the generator number five and you will see there's that tunnel and that tunnel is the lightning staff tunnel simply go from it and the gramophone is required and the wind staff uh, record that I showed you guys earlier as well I showed you the the gramophone and the black record so you need that and teleport to the crazy place and hold X or square or F if you're on PC on that crystal that will appear out of nowhere. Simply get that shit and now we're on to the staff pieces and there are, like always, there are three staff pieces. Now in order to get the staff pieces you need to ride the tank and you need to jump from your tank to the other side and you will see these ledges around the map and that's exactly where you need to go and you will see on the footprint uh, of the robot there will be a part. Normally you cannot get up there, the only way to get up here is by actually jumping from the tank and the tank needs to be active so simply jump go over on the ledge and grab this part from the robot footprint and go back and now the tank will stop by at the tank station and it will recharge and simply once it's done recharging start that shit again and now you need to jump on the excavation side and uh, you will see there's another part grab that and once you get this part simply run back and try and get up to the tank it is going to save you a lot of time as you guys can see I completely missed it but try and get stamina up and run like crazy run and jump there's a strategy but like I, I completely missed it so try and get on that tank it will save you a lot of time but if you miss it hey you can restart it and the last piece is going to be right here you need to jump up here and it's going to be inside the church once you get it go back to the excavation side and build a staff right here and this is how you build the lightning staff very easy and now we need to do two more steps in order to upgrade the lightning staff and the first one is very very easy I will have something on the screen for you guys that will make it super super easy so go back to the crate 
crazy place go from its original portal or any other portal it's not going to matter this time the only time it matters is when you're actually trying to get the crystals so go inside the crazy place and you will see there are a couple of triangles and you want to shoot the down part of these triangles and there will be seven triangles and you need to shoot these three sets of numbers that I will have on the screen for you guys in any order you would like to there is no like uh, you need to shoot that 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 you can shoot in any order you would like to but there are three sets of numbers that you need to shoot so the first one is one three and six the next one is three five seven and the last one is two four six it is very very easy and as soon as you get out of the crazy place now you need to actually go and find the dial now keep in mind you can do this as soon as you spawn in the map you can do this at any time you would like to but I wanted to have specifically in order in the video so once you learn this you can actually do this even when you're on round one as soon as you start your game or whatever but the first dial will be in the spawn simply turn to the right the next dial is going to be in the tank station right here simply move it upwards And uh, the next one is going to be near the footprint, near generator number 4, close to the juggernaut, and you need to turn it down. The next one is going to be downstairs church room, and you need to turn that to the left. And there will be another one upstairs inside the church room, you need to turn that down. And there will be one around the excavation side where you find the black record you need to turn that down and the last one is going to be at stamina up near generator number five near the the lightning staff tunnel and you need to turn that upwards boom you've got the step correct as well now once again like you have done this many times for other steps you need to go ahead inside the excavation side down here and you will see there are four stones and there will be four levers as well so you need to go around pull those levers down till you actually see the purple color and the purple color we already know it represents the lightning staff so pull them down till you actually see those stones uh, showing you the purple color and you will see a ball down here you can shoot it before or you can shoot afterwards simply shoot that ball and you will see once you have done this correctly the ball will go back to the crazy place and you also need to finally go to the crazy place put your staff down and get 20 kills aka 20 souls that is needed in order to upgrade the staff and that is the last step once you get 20 kills boom you now have have the upgraded lightning staff if you need help building other staffs links are always in the description below or you guys can check all other guides on the channel as well but if you have found this video quick and helpful smash a like subscribe if you're new to the channel and i'll see you guys very freaking soon